Welcome back. We're we're stuck in baskets here. Ready, go. And we're we're trying to cycle them real quickly. Ready, but we're only almost getting there. There. We want to make that cycle, I think, because I'm fairly certain we can. Ready, go. That's a big time difference between make that cycle and not. Ready, which is presumably the difference between platinum and not. Ah, the king between us is really, really hard. Ready, I still haven't quite figured out how to get from that third basket to the fourth appropriately. I've only even barely figured out how to get from the second to the third, for that matter. Ready, go. Something like that, I think. But then I need to be... I still, need, I still lose a lot of speed going from the next basket to the one after that. Ready? See, there. I don't know how to not lose my speed there. So I can go, go slight, just Ready? barely over that corner here. It's the gables all over again. I can go just slightly over that hump there. Ah! Bouncing in a weird way there. Like this? But then, I feel like I need to just like ride the side there or something somehow. Just to do it faster. Ready, I don't know how to do that last part fast enough. Ready, it really is like the cables now. It feels like this is actually a very similar scenario and that kind of concerns me. Because I'm basically riding, riding cables here. Ready, Especially on this part here. That's actually pretty much precisely what I'm doing. Ah! I feel so helpless being stuck on one side of these and not being able to get out of them. Come on, I can't even... Ready, go. Ready, go. And oftentimes if I fail once to get over something, I can't get over it at <laughs> Oh no, that was exactly what I needed to do! That was, that was precisely what I needed to do. And it's stupid hard. Ready, it's ridiculously difficult. Was so 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 close. Ready, go. Ready, go. Uh. Ready, go. Ready, Somehow I can do that a little bit more consistently, I think, than I would have expected. More consistently like on the gables at least. Come on, what are you having our time over that? I have a hard time getting over every every one of these. Every step of this still gives me difficulty. Ah. Even the second or third platform is still hard. Because it's such a, a very narrow space that I have to approach from just the right angle at just the right speed and all that. Like that. If I could manage to just ride the, the side like I did the one time, I think I could make it if I did it after a solid run. I think I'd make it, with it without too much problem. I think the one time I almost did, I just had gone a little bit slow before then. Maybe. I don't know. It would still be cutting it a little bit tight, but I think it's possible. Something that I think one doesn't automatically think about much in this game is not just the fact that you're moving the ball really carefully, you're also moving the, you're manipulating the camera the whole time, too, to give yourself both a good view, but also to 
as kind of an aid to your to your left thumb as well. Come on. Why can't I get over this thing now? I still haven't really actually committed consciously to my mind what the right way to get over this is. There we go. I just do it sometimes. And if you ask me how I did it, I have no idea. So I have some muscle memory aspect to it, but I can't do it consistently. And that's followed by something even harder, going over that corner there. Well, the thing was, I think the one time that I managed to do that successfully, I got stuck on it for a moment and lost time because of that, and that's why I didn't actually make it. Sometimes I manage to approach it fairly quickly though, but then it feels like I fall off afterwards. Like there, I, if I could have approached it at the speed I did just there, and then not fall off afterwards, I think that would have been perfect. I think I want to stay on the inside, on the second platform. No, I don't, I don't know what it is that I do when it works. Like, I don't know what I did there distinctly from any other time. It seems like it just works sometimes and other times doesn't. I, I realize I'm doing different things each time, but I can't tell you what those things are. Like there, I don't know why that didn't work. Ah. It is so, so close though. I'm certain that it's possible now. Because that one time that I wrote with that ledge, it's just I need to also do everything else before that perfectly too. Ah. So like if you if you do a total assisted speedrun on this, I I have no question in my mind that you could one cycle this level. I'm fairly certain it's humanly possible too. It's just stupid hard. Like some things are in this game. Uh. It's hard to push myself fast enough over that into that corner without then subsequently throwing myself off. Which also means when I succeed. I ah, tend to lose speed in the process because I might even have to lose speed in the process for it to work. Ready, go. Uh, if I do make it, I think it will, it will be kind of barely, but I do still think I can. These are just like gables in portable form. Am I just bad at this whole, like, angled surface thing? Because, I mean, the gables seem, like, ridiculously hard compared to anything else in the game so far. And I'm on the second last set of levels. And I'm encountering something similar. Where, I mean, at the very least, I could complete the level without much issue, I think. It's just that I think I can get a really good time, too. Ah, it's just so, so close to me, and I haven't quite acquired it yet. I wish I could just skip to that last part and just retry that over and over again. I really do. Because the rest, I know I can do now. Like, I've done it plenty of times. Ah, that was one of the closer ones. One of the closer ones there. Ready, go. Coco's voice just... I don't even notice it most of the time anymore. Ready, now that I mentioned, of course I do. 
I still don't like how I got stuck on the second part from time to time. And I'll just have bouts of not being able to do it. And I, I still don't know what doing it right even entails. I feel like though when I miss it, like I did just now, I get so close that it feels like it, it seems close enough that I would have been able to make it if I hadn't fallen off the edge, which is a big part of why I believe I can do it. I think it is easier to go on the edge in this case because I have three it's just a matter of approaching it correctly, I think. Why do I not even get close to getting over this thing sometimes? Other times I, I go over it in completely the wrong place. Sometimes it's because of weird bounces like that, I guess. In fact, that might be all of it. It might just be how I bounce off of the thing, which I feel like I have a little control over. Hug. And I've had cases where I did this so many times consistently. And I have others where I can't do it at all. I can't do it anymore. Why can't I do it now? I hate it when I, I practice something and get worse at it. Oh! No! Ah! See? I feel like that could have been ever so slightly better. Ah. See, I'm getting so close now. But it can be done. I remember when thought, someone thought it was crazy I got the... I remember when someone thought it was crazy I got the alternate exit in... Level like 12 or whatever it was. I'm not getting... What about this stuff now? That stuff seems like real small change compared to this. It does matter though. I, everything I do does matter, which is good. I was talking earlier about the whole cycle based thing. In this case, it doesn't bother me much because it's based just all about beating a time limit. And everything I do leading up to that matters. <sighs> See, if I had fallen off the side there, I actually would have gotten it. This is why I know that it just takes a really perfect run to get this, but I know that it can be done. And having gone, I, each time I do it, I get really, really close. It gives me more motivation to keep doing it because I know it can be done. But since my performance all the way through this whole thing actually matters for being able to make this cycle, sometimes I think I get it too early. The cycle based nature doesn't matter, or doesn't bother me as much. Because the cycling still doesn't mean that I actually. that all my time up until the very end is wasted. And there's one part that's getting me trouble here in particular, but everything before that still matters. I still need to be fast enough on those other parts for it to... For it to count. Oh, I can't. Part of this too is the difficulty of the camera. I started talking about the camera for a second earlier. I'm trying to move the camera as I do this to get it to a more favorable angle, because otherwise... I have to move myself across that extremely narrow straight line at an awkward angle. Why, why does this happen? I get to... I get into fits of not being able to get over there. I do still wish I could just retry the last part over and over, because I know I can do the others even if not totally consistently. I've done them plenty of times, so it doesn't feel like I'm accomplishing anything by doing them anymore. Especially when I mess them up, and that just means I... Ah, it was an opportunity to 
to the more important part. There was a time earlier where I said that I wasn't going to worry too much about Platinums anymore. YES! And then I got more Platinums. Okay. Uh, I'll look at the next level just to have something in this episode that's not that. What's the idea here? So I think this is actually the last episode of tonight. Oh, is this like that 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 Takeshi's Castle game? Except I'm the boulder now. Oh man, it, it's precisely that Takeshi. It's exactly that. You even have to like go in the little hideaways on the sides. That's amazing. Oh, I despawned. You even have to go into the little hideaways on the side. That's awesome. This is straight up Takeshi's Castle. Is there not a Takeshi's Castle video game? There must be. Like, there must at least be like a Te Takeshi's Castle fan game or something. Yeah. And then, of course, they add the, the challenge of other things to get past. Of course, again, this is psycho based, like so many other things, so. I don't actually have to do these parts too fast. The last one, on the other hand, matters. Of course. I suspect that's this one. Zoom! I don't think I really want to try to do that one faster. Okay. We've gotten mostly platinum here, though. We've done well platinum-wise so far here. And that's almost half of them platinum to begin with. That's an interesting looking last level. That'll be fun. But just to be sure, um... What's one of these levels? Did we ever see those? What was it called? Canal. I mean, wasn't there at some point a modified version of Canal? Or was that actually a level that I had to unlock? And you'd think there'd be a metal, or um, yeah, you'd think it would be in metal mode somewhere. Because it would be really unfortunate if there were actually levels I didn't get to see. Because I wasn't doing that stuff. And it looks like it might be the case. And it makes sense in a way, I guess, if in Shuffle, the, the extra levels are actually there. But darn, that means I probably won't get to see them, which really bums me out, because I really don't want to... It would... I keep in mind how much time it would take to attempt the arcade mode and actually finish it successfully without losing many lives if it takes me multiple attempts like it's a lot of levels and it's not something I would enjoy doing but oh well, well we'll see about that later I wish the game kept count for you to see how many platinums you have I still want to see how you get platinum here I really do but anyways I guess that'll be it for now see you next time in There you go, you took some time to say it. Bye everyone!